Finland's premier golfer Mikko Ilonen has enjoyed a fantastic 2014 season. The Finn claimed his fourth and fifth European Tour victories. On his bag for the last eight years has been South African Reggie Mokosi. The pair are good friends, so Golfing World caught up with them to find out more about their harmonious relationship. 2006, I've, um, Austria. Um, I, I got into the tournament late like Wednesday uh, with a pencil bag and I didn't have a, didn't have a caddy. He had the tiniest golf bag I've ever seen. And then he said, do you mind working for me? I said, yeah, of course, why not? He said, what's the price? And then, and then I said to him, you got the boss. And then he said, okay, I'll give you this. Are you happy with that? I said, perfect. And we made a deal on Wednesday on the range that, you know, if they miss a cut, here comes and caddies for me on the weekend. And he did. We did the same following week in France. They missed the cut, I made it, and he carried it for me in the weekend, and that's, that's how it started. Well, he's very bubbly, you know, he's, he's fairly cheerful all the time, and, and he gets along with, with everybody on the tour, and even, even different, different places where we go, go to, it seems like uh, he knows, or people knows, he knows him. He's not a he's not a talkative person, you know. So it makes the two of us, you know. I'm not, you know, talking a lot when we play golf. I just let him do his own thing, and then I come in when you know I think this is, you know, it's incorrect, and then after that, that's the only time I come in. And even in, in Finland, he he's he's probably the most well-known caddy, that's for sure. And uh, they even gave him a Finnish name for that. Not what was the name? Rezi. Which is a, you know, it comes from a Finnish name called Reio. From, from where I come from and, you know, and work for a foreign player for a long time, I think I'm the most fortunate kid in South Africa. Without a shadow of a doubt. What do you keep in the pockets? Not much in it. So, this is, this is mine and this is his. Ah. This is his. That, 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 that is all, he doesn't even wear waterproof when he's playing some, 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 sometimes, it, you know. He, he puts it on when he's not playing and then he takes it back out. So, these are the only thing, you know. And this is my nice, lovely jacket that I bought in uh, Holland. It has been a fruitful relationship so far, with Miko discovering winning ways in recent times to become one of the top names on the European circuit. They have come a long way in eight years, but what has been the standout moment? We've won five times together, and, and uh, um, the first one is special, obviously, but, you know, one after another, it's, it's been special every time, so... It must be the last win. That would be Miko's victory at the World Match Play Championship, beating Henrik Stenson in the final. Reggie? The best moment is when we won in Jakarta. That was the best moment of my life because I've never won a golf tournament since then. And the funniest thing, I mean, when I started my career, is the year that he was born. So I was telling myself, is this the guy that, he, you know, I've been waiting for? All my mates that you grew up, you know, they've done a lot better than I did then, you know, so I thought that's the best moment, winning my first one. As we all know, relationships have their ups and downs. So what has been the most testing time between them so far? I, I remember a few years back, uh, we sat down after Friday's round in French Open, I, uh, and I, I, I said, if you want to go, please go, you know. I, you know, opened the door for him, uh, but it was voluntarily. You know, I wasn't, I wasn't, I, I wasn't firing him. It was just because I was playing so poorly and it was difficult times. But he, he, that moment, he said, "Don't you ever say that. I will never go if you don't fire me." So <laughs> I said, "You know, if you're gonna leave, you can." I said, "You know what? I'll go down with you if it need to be." And then he was very, very happy. Then you know that you know I knew he, he you know. He was going to be the way he is today, you know, because me being a caddy all my life, you can, you know, you can see who, who is going to be a proper golfer in years to come or, you know, things like that. I guess that's, uh, that's one of the reasons that, I, you know, he's been so loyal and, and I'm, I'm trying to be loyal back to him.
Rightfully so, loyalty goes a long way, especially when you have to take the rough with the smooth. And in a round of golf, there can be a whole roller coaster of emotions. But what is the secret to their partnership? You guessed it. In it goes for a second birdie in a row. Well, I think Reggie's strong point is to, you know, just keep the player on, on his toes and awake. He's not particularly great at reading greens. I have to, I have to mention that. Oh, well, maybe he's. Because it, the thing is, I know he, he slices his putts, so he sees everything left to right. So I don't. It's a bit like me, but I don't see that much slicing. If you were to work for somebody else who's going to ask you every time what club to hit, those people will, you know, this is probably only my opinion. I don't think, you know, they can be top 50 in the world. But when I first cared it for him, you know, he used to ask everything. I said, you know, you've got to take responsibility. You've got to know your game first before me. It doesn't matter, you know, I could tell you if I find, but I don't know how you're going to hit the club. It's best for you to know your game first. And then, you know, it makes it easier for, for me as well. He does the yardages and he he's spot on most of the time. So that's the, mo that's the most important thing anyway. He does uh, give me the, the right numbers. And if I ask his own idea, you know, what, what, it, what it should play like. We thank Miko and Reggie for their insights and wish them both lots more success in the future.